So what have you been doing? You've been you've had a bit of a lay off I've heard. Well, sort of, but we've actually been busy during that time. We tend to what happens is uh, we disappear on the road for ages and make ourselves scarce in the media and uh, go out and do a lot of live shows, uh, get some songs together for another album, change drummers. Uh-huh. And uh, so it kind of brings us up to present times. It's like people in the media kind of tend to go over a big country and not, no, 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 they're, they're finished now. But that album came out, it went top, top five for however many weeks, the, the tour was sold out. People still want to know about you, don't they? Does that surprise you? Um, not at all. I think when, uh, when you're the ones that are out there actually doing the gigs, you know, when you're out there uh, playing to people, sharing the songs with people, and you see the reaction that, that the songs have on people, and uh, for me that's always what it's been about anyway, you know, it's, uh, if people are interested in your work, then that, that's, that's, surely that's what counts. Does it still give you as much pleasure as it did when we were out there, as we boys? I think it does, aye. It's very much so, aye. I think the, the motivation comes from uh, just the sheer spontaneity of, of being involved in it, that whole live thing, you know, and it's something that I really enjoy. I mean, I've been doing that since I was virtually 15 years old, you know, you know. Because when, when I used to work with you, you always used to have a problem of, like, the touring element of it. You, you want to get home because you were always a bit of a family man. Yeah, I'm, I'm still pretty much like that, but I still enjoy the actual playing, you know, once you're out there and on the stage, I think that's it. The travelling's still a bind. I'm still not a great, uh, great traveller, but the playing's what it's all about. Do you still have that like enthusiasm about writing a song or sitting down and writing a song? Obviously, you don't have the inspiration that I used to give you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what do you write about now? Um, I write about people in situations. You know, I like to sort of uh, pe put people in, in, into situations where they have to uh, to react to the adversity they find themselves in, and tell little stories about it. But those are the kind of things I write about. Because before it used to be like, the big metaphors, you know, the mountains, That's the, right, the, the yeah. valleys. I think. Uh, that's something when you when you first sit down to write lyrics, those things are attractive because you can hide any meanings you want to in all those big metaphors, you know. And I think as your confidence grows and as you become more sure of yourself, you start to you can get a bit more uh, introverted about it.